Okay, as promised, here's the video that I said I would do to show you how the pile, uh, I think it's PMYLCA20 as opposed to the 10, um, is set up um, on my bike anyway. I've got the phone there, which I use as an MPEG-3 player, sat-nav, radio, everything. And um, there's the speakers that are on the and the bars. The entire unit, I actually just put it inside the um, tool roll on the front. And this one comes with a handy on off switch, which is there. And um, I've got it set into the um, switched live, so it won't ever be on unnecessarily. So press the button and he's on, press the button and he's off. So, but that is, as I said, that is in the switched live. So, he's on at the moment. So, all I'll do is put the jack plug in, which I need to set up properly so it goes exactly where I want it to go. And then basically, I'll press play. And I'll use my phone as the volume. Although it has got a volume on the unit, but I find it easier to use the phone volume. My curiosity running wild. Then as I'm going along, I can quickly change the song to whatever I want it to be. Extremely good unit. It's 100 watts, which is which is plenty because I've got Banton Heinz cruisers on, and um, they they work well. The speakers up to 70 mile an hour. Then you start to lose the sound, but that's because you're driving extremely quickly with lots of noise coming out of your pipes. So. As you can see, it's like very easy to operate because you just use your phone or MPEG-3 player or whatever and it's just play and very simple to operate. So I'll just flick through the music. It's a very good unit. The, the speakers, as you can see, are um, chromed. I mean, they're chromed plastic, 